take a drive through downtown Mobile and you see how hard it is for small businesses to survive. But empty storefronts and four lease signs don't scare Victor Mosley. You see, Victor has a dream. A dream that one day his small home office merchandise business will make it big. Well, Jason, I really would like to have a shop along a major thoroughfare. So it's, it's available to a lot of people to come in and see what I'm offering. You know, if, if I can get that up and running, then I could branch out and hire some people. You know, just keep it growing. You come up with $2,000 down. This morning, Victor and other aspiring entrepreneurs took part in a special seminar designed to help minority businesses. About a dozen people attended today's workshop. Some have already started small businesses. Others are looking to get theirs off the ground. Folks say this was an excellent chance to ask questions and get some very important answers. After this meeting today, it seems like it's uh, going to be a lot easier now. I think I've gone over the bumpy parts at the other ones, but since I'm able to talk to these people, I think it'll be a big help. The business is going to be successful. One of today's guest speakers was Al Johnson president of Commonwealth Bank in Mobile. He says we need more minority-owned businesses. The best advice I can give them is uh, you got to put together a business plan. You got to define uh, what type of business you're in. You got to define your market. And those are critical elements that uh, you should look at. Anyone interested in learning more about starting your own business, you can call the Minority Business Development Center at 930-9254.